Hey guys, it's Megan and welcome to today's video. We are doing a fall and Halloween shop with me. I did this shopping trip a couple days ago and when I edited the video, I realized I need to do a new intro because I was not thinking about the hurricane at all. And if you don't know, I live in Florida and we now have a hurricane coming our way. At that point, we didn't really know if it was going to come or how severe it was going to be. So, I didn't address it at all in that video, but now knowing what it's going to be and that it's coming this way, I figured I would shoot a new little intro and let you know that I wasn't willy-nilly shopping as the hurricane was coming. Um, it was a couple days before we actually knew that we were most likely going to get hit. If you are in the path of Hurricane Irma, I hope that you stay safe and you make sure to listen to all of the warnings and evacuations and don't test mother nature. I've been through a lot of hurricanes living in Florida and sometimes they completely, sur not surpass you, they complete you, completely end up passing you and sometimes you get hit. So it's better to be safe than sorry. But I did want to get this video out there in case any of you guys are not in the path and planning on doing any fall or Halloween shopping, you can see some awesome things that are at Ross, Home Goods, and Dollar Tree right now. So hope you enjoy the video. Home Goods had some really pretty table runners. I love a beautiful table runner and they definitely had some pretty ones for the fall or if you wanted to go more Halloween, they had some cool Halloween ones too. As well as these placemats, I love these so much and you can use them in other areas other than your, just your dining room table as well. So I think that there's a lot of cool options out there right now. The amount of amazing hand towels is like crazy. I found so many hand towels that were just so cute. I wanted to get so many of them. But one thing I love about these hand towels or just hand towels in general are they're so affordable and they can really change the way a room feels in your kitchen and your bathrooms by just incorporating some festive hand towels. I just found so many cool sugar skull hand towels as well. I was really surprised at the amount of sugar skull stuff I saw. I wish I would have gotten that grateful one because that was so pretty. Oh, the Halloween stuff was so cute. I wanted to buy so much of it, but I didn't. I was good, but oh, if you are in the need for some more Halloween decor, Home Goods has some good stuff right now. These skeleton wine glasses, oh, so cute. I am obsessed with these cake stands. This little ghost. I don't have any turkeys and I am going to start getting some turkeys to put up in my fall and Thanksgiving decor because I feel like I need some turkeys in my life. But these little pumpkins, adorable. 
The amount of cool pumpkins that they have these days is insane. Like I just wanna keep collecting cool pumpkins because there are so many. There are so many cool skulls as well out there. They're just so different. They really stepped up Halloween decor, that's for sure. They had so many gorgeous wreaths as well and centerpieces for the table. I loved so many of them. I actually want to get another um, fall wreath, so I think I'm going to go back sometime soon and pick up a fall wreath. That pumpkin patch little box is so pretty. These marble pumpkins are really cool too. On to Ross. They had some cute hand towels there as well, but I actually liked Home Goods a little bit better. But I do love that happy fall, y'all, with the gray in there. Ross had so much sugar skull stuff. It was crazy, the selection that they had. If you're looking for some sugar skull stuff, I would definitely head to your local Ross. They had some really cool throw pillows. I really liked a lot of them. Thank you. 
I was so close to buying this and I wish I would have. This guy too, so cute. On to Dollar Tree. They had so much floral out. I loved those dahlias. Those were such a good find. If you need some little Halloween figurines, Dollar Tree, well at least mine, has so many out right now and I think I need to go back and pick some up because I have a little thing that I want to do with them. I have been imagining in my head so I think I want to head back there because I didn't pick any up. And little houses. If you need spiders, holy moly, Dollar Tree's got you covered with some spiders and bats. That's for sure. I think I want to get some of these little lanterns for my patio. I've used them before, the other holiday ones, and they look really cute out there. These felt stickers were really cool too. They have so many adorable Halloween stickers still, and I just think the glittery ones are so pretty. I love Dollar Tree signs so much. I swear I could buy every single one. I just love their signs. The Sugar Skull. and then the other Sugar Skull window clings. These molds look really cool. I've never really used molds before, um, so I don't know how well they work, but they looked cool. And these chair covers, they can be cute on certain chairs. Some of them are a little chintzy looking, but you know, they can work. I love this plate with a little spider on it. And these inflatable like Frankenstein and witches and stuff, I don't know what those look like, but they, they intrigue me a little bit. These glow in the dark little creatures. I think I need some. If any of you guys have used any of the glow in the dark ones, how do how well do they actually glow in the dark? Do they? Or is it kind of just say they do and they don't really? So much garland. love those little LED pumpkins that are glittery. I think they're so cute. And the bows are so pretty.
Those little witch's hats were cute too. I wish I would have grabbed those acorns because I have not seen them again and I think they would be really cute for little DIYs. This Dollar Tree definitely was not short on floral, that's for sure. And these little kitty like bowls I thought were adorable. seen this little fairy skirt that's cute if you need a little costume a fairy is always an easy thing for a little girl to do but I was quite impressed with the selection of, of little costume ideas for little boys too they definitely have stepped up their game with like costume supplies for sure so that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed the shop with me. Make sure to give it a thumbs up if you enjoy shop with me. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, I would love to have you subscribe. Again, if you are in the path of Hurricane Irma, please be safe. I'm praying for everyone's safety and just make sure to listen to all of the warnings and evacuations. It's so very important. It's just not worth it to risk anything. So stay safe, everyone. We're gonna be hunkered down. We are not supposed to get directly hit but you still never know, the paths can change, so fingers crossed, it kind of turns east, east and goes back into the ocean and misses us, but you never know, and it could affect lots of other people, possibly going up into Georgia or the Carolinas, so just everyone stay safe out there, and I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.